well, we're heading into Thanksgiving. There's nothing you can do about it. It's just coming at you, and you got to get ready. How are you get ready? You know, some people are, you know, buying stuff, getting recipes together or whatever, figuring out who they're going to invite, figuring out if they're going to not invite certain family members and just have Thanksgiving at a different house so that person can't find them this year. You know, all things you got to really think about. It. And I've been fighting a cold. You know, you don't want to be sick around the holidays, but that seems to be it because you're in close quarters with so many people. You're bound to get sick and somebody gives you something you don't want and they and all that kind of thing. So I'm trying to just figure out how to how to keep keep it steady till it's till it's time. I know in the next week or so y'all are gonna be getting your centerpieces together. I can't wait to see your tab and turkeys that you put together, boy. And I'll put the link here for last week's video so you can see how to make one. The beautiful, beautiful, uh, simple and economical centerpiece for your Thanksgiving celebrations. And I never uh, thought of myself as too much of a crafty kind of guy, but I got it in me. I got it in my blood now, I guess. I can make things that are beautiful and, and economical and celebratory. I've been investing lately in cough drops. Uh, Mort Dwight Elsa, like, Tavin, you should open a cough drop store. I said, why? He said, well, because you have so many cough drops. And first of all, nobody wants just a cough drop store. Uh, that seems like more of a seasonal thing, more like a table or a booth you'd have at a fair, different kind of cough drops, but not like a whole store. I mean, that just don't make good business sense. I'm a businessman, and maybe I'm overthinking it because I'm a little bit sick, but uh, Mort just kind of hushed up after that, so he probably thought maybe uh, he hadn't thought about it too much neither. Do you have a checklist for Thanksgiving? Like, mine's like, be thankful and show up. And I think that's probably pretty good advice for all life, man. If you can just be thankful and show up, uh, you may you may do all right. And I'm going to try to get better this week, so next week I have a little more energy maybe i can do a somersault video or something i do a pretty good somersault though that's the truth yeah you staple gun my neck because you were upset that was my cue to run now i'm unemployed and my friends are all annoyed i'm living